Hey guys, how's it going? Pig Bennis here. Still doing a little Rip to Rampage. It's going to be the last Rip to Rampage episode. I promise you guys that. It's uh, it's coming to an end here. Uh, actually, probably in a, a week or two, I think. I think it's the 12th. I could be wrong. It may be the 20th. Either way, it's got a 2 in it. <laughs> I know that much for sure. Uh, using the Cap 303 Arctic uh, A104. Yes, I still am sick, so my voice is kind of crackly and shit, but a little bit of coffee here, and hopefully that'll keep it down. Yeah, I'll try to, uh, try to suck on that for a bit. Anyway, the third and final episode of Ripped or Rampage, uh, I'm doing alright. I'm getting some globals, I'm getting some decent globals. The last week has been, uh, very good to me. Uh, globals have been pretty much a bountiful a uh, couple every, every, uh, every couple hours right off the bat. Damn, that's the second time, second bit in a row I did that. Which is kind of funny, because I was just on for an hour and didn't hit anything, so. Um, yeah, so what was that? That was, uh, Hydra? Cetus, female Cetus helmet. I don't think there's a markup on the female, yeah, no. Um... So, yeah, kind of weird loot. Last couple of days, been looting a lot of Law 303, which is a um, somewhat of a mid-level laser carbine. Come on, pig fire. Uh, yeah, and then uh, got a, a Mako Blizzard, son of a biatch. Did not see that coming. Did not see that coming. Oh, well. Where are we at here? Let's just throw a waypoint down. We'll head right back. That's just, that just sucks. I don't get too much of them, actually. Usually I could heal right through, but that was 115 points. That was, that was pretty substantial. We'll use the, uh, the 2350. Just to heal up real quick. Been switching around with the, uh, my off fap. Uh, right now I've got a combat fap 6, which is kind of neat. It's quick. It's, uh, 38 uses per minute. I'm not sure about the eco on it. I never really looked at it. Um, but I've had it for a bit now. Heals 9 to 10, or not, 9 to 12 per click. It's not too shabby. I was using the uh, just the regular Gyro Fap 6 before that, uh, and a 14 before that. And so I'm just kind of going through the Gyro Faps and seeing what's, you know, seeing what's out there, what's available, using basically what, what is here on Arcadia in the auction house for a reasonable price. Uh, when I first started this off using the BSF Camos, which I do like very much, have her here on, um, oh, where's that Ripper? Well, I was using the, the, the Guardian here, that's the one I was killing. Have her here on Arcadia, the, uh, the BSF is kind of really hard to get. Uh, there is some, someone selling them for 138%, just not worth it. Uh, it's worth the 108, 110% that you would find them on uh, Calypso. That's an awesome gun, the BSF Camos. I, re I really, really liked it. The uh, Eco on it seemed pretty reasonable too. But the uh, the Cap series is uh, uh, much more plentiful. And uh, the, the markup has gone down in price, too. It's only like 118%. Now let's see if we can... There we go. Just a, just a kind of a, a freak of nature there. That I get critted like that. Handling these, these guys okay. Even the, uh, even the alphas. I mean, I usually have to heal during the alphas a little bit here and there. It's not too bad. Pulling with the SGA Apollo, which is a sweet little, sweet little polar, eco as hell. Uh, it's perfect for the Ripters because the Ripters, once they get in the inner circle, you start aggroing them, um, and it just so happens the SGA shoots right at that inner circle, so it pulls them quite effectively. And, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's what we're doing. We've gotten quite a few... Quite, quite a few globals last couple days. Um, you know, it does come in waves. Every once in a while, you get a bunch of globals, and then it'll die down. Um, the Richter skin 
doesn't seem to be dropping as much as it had when we first started. Ooh, 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 look at that. That's my first ESI on these. Oh, damn. 19 ped. Oh, I'll take that. That's awesome. Holy shit, guys. This is incredible. First ESI of the whole event. I don't even know how many I've killed. Probably about a thousand by now. I think I have um, 23 globals or something like that. But that was a great little alpha. I did not expect to see an ESI. If I were hunting maybe prowlers or stalkers, I would probably probably see them a little more frequently. But that's that's cool. I went hours last night without a global. <clears throat> Finally to um, to loot at Law three hundred three. Which is kind of unfortunate because uh, the markup bottom has dropped from about 120 and change to about 110. And even at 110%, I can't really sell them. People just are not buying them, unfortunately. So, Same with the Mako Blizzard uh, that I looted the other day. 205 ped worth. It was a nice, nice global. Some of the globals are just really, really nice uh, with the items and whatnot. Unfortunately, you know, the Hydra and the Cetus uh, have not been selling. But it's a good little event. I'm hoping to, you know, I don't think I'll get most globals. Uh, I'm not sure who's in the lead. There's no leaderboard, which is unfortunate, but it adds to the mystery. So I do have a lot of globals on these. I, I don't see... Anybody else um, really frequenting this particular block of Richter's? So, who knows? Who knows, you know? Hoping to, you know, get some sort of unlimited item from this. The, um, the secondary items that you get uh, if you don't win the, you know, the grand prize are basically shots I think or pills that add skill bonus increases uh, for either five to ten hours I think they're ten hours for the uh, Arcadia event five for the Merry Mayhem which is not that great I don't think I think it's kind of a, a crummy prize because skills really you know for a minor they don't necessarily mean all that much I think if I do win one of those, though, if I do win one of the secondary prizes, um, I think what I'll do is, <clears throat> sorry about that, guys, is grind healing at maybe Nia's or the Sweat Camp or something like that. I think that would be um, a good choice for that. So, still sick. I just can't kick it, guys. I uh, went to the doctors today. Bronchitis and sinus infection. So, uh, I promise videos. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put out videos. <clears throat> but I know you guys don't want to hear me <laughs> coughing into the mic and sounding like shit. So, I'll try the best I can. Uh, hopefully have a Planet Side video coming out here soon. I hope you guys are liking them because I really enjoy playing Planet Side. Um, and thanks for all the new subs. We we hit 900 last night, which is awesome. Uh, never would have thought I've seen the day. Uh, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to hit a thousand by what I say January 7th. I think for the level 12 giveaway. So, um, and if we don't hit it, then I'll have to challenge you guys again. Uh, f with a with a new prize, you know, hell with it. Other than that, uh, there's not too much going on right now in Entropy, other than you know the the Christmas events, which are somewhat finishing up here. Um, in the gaming world, um, you know, a, a lot of developers kind of take this time off, so there's no new games being released or. Uh, really being worked on just yet um, you know Elder Scrolls Online is 
hopefully set to release in the spring. We may see Neverwinter Nights Online uh, release in the spring. Um, what else? What else do we have here? That's probably about it. That really comes to my mind, anyway. I myself have been playing, obviously, Planetside Two. You know, obviously, in Tropy every single night. I've been, I've been at this event, and um, RPGs, RPGs. I bought Dragon's Age Origins, which. <clears throat> It's not the game I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be like a first-person type of role-playing game. Uh, similar to that of Divinity 2. But it's not. It's more or less uh, like a Boulder's Gate style of game. Which is alright. <clears throat> it's got an enthralling storyline. I started it. I was a little disappointed at first. Because it was extremely linear in the tutorial. And... Um, Boy, there's some there's some nice globals in my block right there. The 202, that must that must have been a gun. I'm thinking that was a gun. That's alright. I mean I got I got a couple nice globals there. But uh yeah, Dragon's Age Origins, just it's kinda like I was a little disappointed. I mean I I bought it for like eight bucks, so like I really can't complain. Um the Steam sales this year, I think, were shit. I, the way they did them was terrible. I just want to throw that out there right now. Um, we didn't get the deals that we had gotten in previous years. And I was, I was somewhat very disappointed. I picked up a couple of things. Obviously, Dragon's Age Origins. Uh, I picked up Doom 3. Uh, a couple other games I just don't remember that are just not striking my memory right now. But uh, yeah, Dragon's Age is more like a Baldur's Gate style game, which is awesome. I've played through Baldur's Gate, played through Icewind Dale. You could get those two games on uh, GOG. And GOG lately just has not had anything new and exciting. Let's see what happens with this Richter if he if he gives me money, money. So what was that? That ESI was twenty pen. That's my coffee cup, sorry guys. <laughs> that ESI was 20 ped, 800%. 160 ped, right? Is that what we're going for here? Da, da, da. And obviously my mind's not working. Yeah, 160 ped. We're going to get back to the basics here. Um, once Ripped or Rampage is over. Uh, I'm thinking next week, I may release a, a mining video before next week, depending on how I feel. I'm hoping to really get better in the next couple of days. Doc will put me on antibiotic and um, codeine. So. Um, so I'll probably do like a mining blog, vlog type of uh, video after, you know, in a couple of days. And then um, I'm going to put out a video uh, for mining depth. Because it's a question that people ask me just about every day. Uh, mining depth is something that I, I really never got into. Um, even in my ebook, I don't get into it. It's not really. Uh, it doesn't affect really my my uh, my mining, so to speak. Uh, but there are some interesting theories, and you guys should be knowledgeable about that. Um, and the way I'm going to present it is. Um, Pretty much the way I presented some other informational videos, uh, such as how I run my um, my balance sheets and my cost sheets in Entropia. And uh, you guys could see those videos on my channel um, on here on YouTube if you go into the playlist. I think it's under Guides. Um, so it's basically going to be an Excel sheet <clears throat> explaining uh, mining depth, how it affects your finders, how it affects you. Uh, how it affects other miners within the region. Um, some of it's uh, very theory based. So we'll get into um, a popular theory about depth and we'll also get into some facts and also some misconceptions. So <clears throat> I'm hoping to finish that up by next week. Let's uh, throw out a slip here. Oop. It's not my lucky one, but 
take it anyway. <laughs> my lucky one. The red one's my lucky one. I love that one. I almost bought a new hum, uh, a new Humvee last night. I stopped my kit, Honey Kitten Little store here in Arcadia, and she's got this purple um, Humvee or MK Explorer. That's what it is, really. And it's freaking awesome looking. And I'm not sure the texture and color. It's purple, and I can't remember the texture. I want to say it's a Wiko. I'm not sure, though. But it was only like 100 pet. I'm like, oh, damn, I could do that. No problem. So. <laughs> yeah, so I hope everybody had a, a happy New Year's. I haven't talked to you since last year. It's a long time. <laughs> and, uh. Hope it was safe for everybody. And... Oh, come on, baby. Give me a huff. Oh, shit. I have not hoffed on these yet. And how long has it been? Two weeks? Something like that? So, New Year's was. was good. I mean, I, I worked, obviously. I said that in my last video. Um, but I work with my wife sometimes, and she worked with me on New Year's. It was good. It was a long day. It was about 14 hours. Non-stop. And, uh, cooked, uh, filet mignon, lobster tail stuff with crab meat. They had a raw bar. We, we put out a nice raw bar. Oysters on the half shell. Clams on the half shell. Shrimp cocktail. Oh my god, they had so much food, it was it was quite ridiculous. And then he moved on to a pasta course, and I did a red pepper coolis, which is a red pepper sauce, uh, with uh, angel hair pasta. And I butterflied some jumbo shrimp and stuffed a, uh, a sea scallop in the middle, a little butter garlic sauce on top, served that, and... Um, it wasn't a massive party. We, we did about 180 people. And then uh, we did a flambe station for dessert, which was cool because it's not every day I get to do a flambe station. And um, I'd love to set shit on fire. <laughs> That's terrible. But uh, we did Cherry Jubilee, which is uh, Bing Cherry. In uh, like a basically, a, you know, cherry juice or uh, cherry syrup with brandy, a little bit of butter, a little bit of uh, brown sugar to even out the uh, the alcohol, light it on fire, and uh, yeah, cherries jubilee. And we also did uh, bananas foster too. And then you serve it on top of vanilla bean ice cream or vanilla ice cream or whatever. So it's a bunch of stuff uh, I don't get to do every day. It was great. <clears throat> exciting and um, of course working on New Year's you know, a little bit of lag here so that's gonna kind of suck but all right hold on hold on hold on are we coming or coming back around coming no 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 we're not all right we're back yeah so Every once in a while, once once I get past that 15 minute mark, sometimes it just lags. And it's not the game, it's the computer. Um, I've got so many games on my computer. Probably, probably close to 100 on Steam. And um, most of them are on the same hard drive. I'm going to have to either partition this hard drive or just probably buy a new hard drive just for... Just for recording, I think. So I think that's probably my best bet. Just to get a, like a terabyte hard drive, something, something quick. Anyway, I forgot what I was saying. New Year's. Oh yeah, it was it was a good time. I got home about three in the morning. After all was said and done, cleaned up and whatnot. So. And uh, New Year's Day worked again. And had last two days off, uh, took today off, so it's been good. Couple of globals, you know? What else can you ask for? Can't ask for much more than an ESI. That's for fucking certain. 
So, yeah. We'll have new stuff here. And I know I've been saying it, like, repeatedly. I just need to, I need to kick this cold. Planet side video. Um, I, I don't know why I can't record vent. It just, um, for some reason, it's just, it's screwed up every time. But I did manage to solve the echo, the echoing problems that I had. Let's take this alpha out and then we'll call it at that. So, the new video um, is just basically some gameplay without vents in it, although I have that horrible vent push the talk screech every once in a while in it. It's a fun game, but there's, there, there's still a couple of things wrong with it. Um, primarily vehicles. Uh, sometimes the battles are just vehicle battles, and it sucks when you're infantry. And sure, you could go, you know, you could battle in a vehicle, but... Um, for me, it's not as fun. Uh, I like playing the Reaver for the new conglomerate, but I don't really like playing any of the tanks. They're just somewhat big and bulky, I just don't. Um, I don't like them. Although I, I've uh, I've gotten some certifications for the Sunder. Let's do some quick fap in here just so we don't get killed, critted. Come on, baby, give me a half. Let's end this puppy with a half. <laughs> no, well, you know I can't ask for too much, guys. I think two globals is freaking wicked awesome. Uh, especially with when it's got an ESI in it. And thanks for watching. We'll have a couple mining videos. This is the last rip to Rampage, the last hunting with Big Ben is for a while. And uh, we'll see you in the next vid. Thanks for watching.